In this lecture, we will learn about chi-square distribution and its relevance to data analysis. Let's start by understanding what is a chi-square distribution. Let's go to mini tab and play a little bit with data. So here we are in mini tab and I have in uh, these four columns some data. So what kind of a data have I generated? I have generated standard normal data, which means I have generated data which has a mean of zero and a standard deviation of one. And like this, I have collected 500 rows of data. I assume each one of these columns to be a sample. This is very similar to what I did with central limit theorem. But now, instead of just going and finding out their average as we did in central limit theorem, now I'm going to square these values. So I'm going to take x1 and square that and put it here. And likewise, I'm going to square x2, x3 and x4. 